Well, it was another beautiful Saturday for us, a flawless night for our Beyonce fans out there. Of course, let's bring in Tim Williams now with a look at what we can expect for tomorrow. Are the Beyonce fans going to be as lucky as they are tonight? Yeah, actually, they had two really nice nights, and I'm wondering where they are now. I think the concert might still be going on, you know, so they might all still be running around Landover. If you hear a lot of noise, a lot of music, then you'll know that the Beehive is all up and down 295 right now. It's a beautiful night. Certainly is going to be another beautiful night tomorrow with no rain in the forecast, just a little bit of an overcast sky, but it's just a very comfortable temperature. Let's talk about those temperatures. 75 degrees right now is where we're sitting at BWI, Thurgood Marshall. The winds from the west southwest bringing in some warmer, humid air. So we do have a little bit more of a humid feel. It's not, I won't say it's really muggy, but you do notice the humidity. It feels like a true 75. So don't think that there is going to be much by way of a real feel, at least not tonight. But it is going to be a night that we start to feel the humidity levels going up just a little bit. Just a little overcast sky out there. You see the blue through that little layer of haze there. And we're going to see that again tomorrow. Sun will peak through. We got to 88 degrees uh, today. That is the average for this time of year. 67 was where we hit overnight. We'll be back down in that same range again tonight. Right on target for the normal highs for this time of year. Record of 104. Certainly not near that. And that is a good thing. Temperature right now across the state 71 in Bel Air, 75 in Westminster, 72 in Frederick, 76 in Hagerstown. We do have 68 down in Ocean City. City, where the high got to 82 degrees today. So even with the breeze coming in off the water at times with a bit of an easterly flow, the temperature right there on the shore got to 82. 86 in Salisbury, just a little farther in. And then 86 in Westminster was our high for the day out in Carroll County. 85 in Hagerstown. And still, Cumberland has been trending warmer than many uh, spots on the map. Got to 91 yesterday in Cumberland. Again, more sun out west of, say, the uh, 70 corridor than and many places right around the Beltway. For the next several hours, 78 degrees is uh, where we'll be sitting right around downtown. And then 77 by around 2 o'clock, 3 a.m., we'll hit about 76. And then we'll get down to the uh, low 70s before the night is out. We talked about those temperatures around the state, but they are reflecting cer certainly that southwest flow coming in from uh, our neighbors down to the south. And look at these temperatures still even at this hour. 78 in Little Rock, 95 in Dallas, 95 in Albuquerque. Phoenix can't get away from that 110 range. And we're looking at temperatures around 82 even in Atlanta. That is the flow that southwest uh, wind is going to continue to bring that flow in from those uh, states. And they're going to continue to pump our temperatures up. So high pressure keeps our temperatures, even with the cloud cover, up in the upper 80s. We do not have rain in the forecast until we get to about Monday or so. And then with that, we're going to start to see the better chance of some showers. So 68 degrees tonight, partly cloudy tomorrow, 88 degrees. And then we're looking at temperatures going up to about 92 on Monday, 88 and 87 for Tuesday and Wednesday, 90 on Thursday, each one of those days with a good bit of sunshine. And then we'll start talking about the better chance for some showers heading into next weekend. Kelsey?